Hello and thanks for joining us on TVC Midday News. We begin the news uh, in the nation's capital where the House of Representatives is set to transmit the latest proposed constitutional amendment to President Muhammad Buhari for assent. Three of the 35 bills ready for the president's signature include power to summon the president and governors enforcement of legislative summons and separation of the office of the attorney general of the federation from the office of the minister of justice national assembly correspondent jokadisa has details section 9 subsection 2 of the 1999 constitution as amended provides that an act to alter the provisions of the constitution can be passed only when it is supported by two-third majority of states the two chambers of the Ninth National Assembly in February 2022 presented 68 bills seeking to alter the provisions of the Constitution. After much deliberations, both chambers approved 44 of the bills and transmitted same to the State Houses of Assembly in March for their concurrence. In October last year, the Joint Committee on Constitutional Review raised the alarm, accusing 25 states of frustrating the process. On and on. After many months of delay, the House says 35 of the 44 bills are now in its kitty from the states. House resolves direct the clerk of the National Assembly to transmit 35 bills that have so far met the requirement of the provision of subsection 9, subsection 2 of the Constitution to Mr. President for asset. While the lawmakers lament critical bills such as the one seeking to grant autonomy to the local governments, were turned down by the states. The autonomy of local governments that will play when these states that have not yet done, if they are able to pass it, it will also come and those other ones will, will, will see the light of the day. The lawmakers took a matter of urgent national importance from Kogi legislator Leke Abejide on the unabated petrol scarcity across the country. There is the allegation of drop in the petrol supply to marketers by private depots, which is creating a dangerous mindset in the country. Concern that the current first scarcity across the country may worsen in the days ahead with the introduction of 16 naira per liter. The House has also moved to overhaul the nation's fire service and impute the use of technology to fight recurring fire disasters across the country. I rise to move that a bill for an act to amend the Fire Service Act, Cap F Laws of the Federation of Nigeria 2004, be read for a second time. The House confirms it received the resolutions from 27 states and is hopeful others will turn in their imputes. Jokeyatsa, TVC News, Abuja.